very late winner today, Neil. How do you assess that one? I've just said to the boys in there, you know, we don't really want to assess the game too much. Um, difficult game, um, difficult, difficult circumstances. Um, so I think it's just, it's just one of them where you take your three points um, and move on. You know, we all, everyone enjoys last minute winners um, in football. So, yeah. You must be really proud of the way that your team dug in today, especially after going down to 10 men. Well, the 10 men, unless somebody else can tell me different, I don't know what the lads been sent off for. The goalkeepers come for the ball. They both jumped into each other. I think Josh might have jumped a little bit later, but there's no contact. Um, but the referee, or you know, he's looking, or particularly second half. Gee whiz, um, we haven't seen anything like it. Um, so, but as I say, we've uh, we've dug in and we've got to, to um, the three points. Uh, Bailey Passant was back in goal today. Uh, how's his hand? As far as you know, I've not spoken to him. It looked okay. Um, young Liam, um, I don't the thigh slightly um, last week um, and also Atkinson you know we called him and um, so Joe was Bailey we always knew as I said previously that he'd be back probably after the stage which game in terms of availability young, Lee, young Liam's done really well for us um, but yeah it's just another game tonight where today sorry where you've just got to dig in it's difficult you know Belper are fighting to, to stay in the league um, for me I, I just give them you know the, we, We've said, you know, we've got done up to 13 now, I think we said 14 before the game. It's just a case of just going for it, trying to win the game. That's what we tried to do at the end there, putting, you know, players forward, you know, attacking, more attacking midfield players on, just trying to get the goal, you know, because um, it's no good, you know, taking draws. We may as well try and go for it. You know, the key thing is, people you, you might think I'm mad, and that probably puts us, you know, safe in this league. And I know people by, you know, your sevens and things like that, but. That was our agenda at the start of the season and we've reached that with 14 games or 13 games to go which is great credit to, to the players um, and now we move on to the game next week. Uh, in terms of any other injuries, uh, any closer to coming back, Craig Curran in particular? Craig Curran, no, not at the moment, uh, he's had a little bit of a setback um, so we'll look at that probably um, the end of the week um, or towards the end of the week. So no, Mark Howarth now though is um, free from suspension so gives us an option to come back. Um, and then we'll see what what we can bring. You know, we're looking to bring the forward in if we can this week. And um, hopefully that will happen in the early part of the week. Um, but as I say, we just um, you know today wasn't a great game. Um, plenty of endeavour from both sides, I think. Um, but far too far too many fouls, free kicks, stoppages. Um, and, and um, you know, unless someone can tell me different, and you know, I'm gonna not say too much until I've seen it myself because I didn't see it at the time. But um, I'll need to have a look for sending off again. And as for next week, more town, uh, what can you tell us about then? Played them away and I thought it was a good game. I think it was the start of our, um, you know, we had, we had a bit of a slump and then, not slump, but we lost a few and but we weren't at our best. Then we went to Morpeth and played really well. Um, we won 2-0, there was a good game, um, two committed sides. And they were up there at the time, I think they were fourth or fifth at the time. And it's, it's, it's like anything in, in football, but also in these leagues, lads, you know, you lose confidence quite quick and it's key to try and keep winning games. They're a good side and I don't know what the results are today, but we know the tough opponents, you know, Belper, tough opponents, away from home. Good thing is, we're at home, so um, fans have turned out again today. Unbelievable. Big thanks to them. Hopefully that last minute winner always helps, doesn't it? Um, when they're on the way home um, in the pubs later. So we thank them um, and we look forward to a tough more game next weekend. Cheers, Neil. Cheers, guys.